Hey, what's going on guys? John here, and today I wanted to do a video review for the APS um, waterproof power strip. So in this video, I'll just walk you through what came in the box, I'll walk you through the power strip, and then just give you some of my general overall thoughts. So starting with the um, setup here, it comes inside this box. Um, this particular power strip has six AC outlets, three USB ports, and it has a six foot long cord. Um, this is the power strip here, so just kind of going through it. Um, this is basically designed to be something that could actually have water spills on it. So maybe, let's say you were setting up like an aquarium or something like that, and you accidentally spilled water over the edge. This is something that would be protected. Um, you do have a waterproof switch here as well. It's basically behind this protective cover. Um, pretty simple to switch right through it. Doesn't really give you any issues. You have a really thick, long um, six foot cord here. This has a standard plug, so nothing really fancy about this. And the USB ports are right here on the front. So all of these are powered. This does not have any USB-C, um, but ultimately I like the way they set this up because all of these have pretty good spacing. So if you're using something that's maybe got a little bit larger brick, you're not really gonna run into placement issues here uh, regardless of where you put it. Uh, beyond that, it does just come with a small manual, pretty straightforward. Kind of just gives you some safety warnings. Um, it recommends not immersing the entire product in water, and if it is, to unplug it. Um, it recommends making sure that there's a drain hole to avoid any accumulated water. Don't daisy chain more power strips, anything like that. Um, and then it just goes over uh, kind of a diagram and some of the features, things like that. So anyway, pretty simple product. Um, definitely nice if you're looking for something that is waterproof and has good placement and a long cable length. Anyway, thanks for watching and talk to you later.